I like to uh, show you uh, to make my point because I don't think uh, most understand about parasites. So you see, aggressive, uh, localized on a 35 years old uh, woman. You see the biofilm from this uh, area where you have the deep pocket. So now is the biofilm at uh, low magnification. Now you see a lot of movement of bacteria and also some spots which are uh, parasites. So now high magnification, you see a lot of, uh, mostly it's white cell, neutrophil, okay, PMN neutrophil with granules inside. On top here is uh, amoeba going, uh, going south, east, okay, slowly. But you see the little granule into the macrophage here, some more neutrophil, uh, some red cell going down, an amoeba here going up. Macrophage on the right, uh, lower right. Uh, see movement, some sparicate, of course, and fusiform bacteria. But see in the middle, the amoeba going east. Lower, uh, a little baby amoeba on the left now. Uh, in the center, three amoeba, one, two, three, four, uh, going uh, west side. So now you see one big one with the pseudopod going on the left side. Uh, some neutrophils, some spirochetes, amoeba, many, one, two, three, with the pseudopod. Now I just want you to watch, uh, this is pus, this is what's into the pocket, okay? So I understand there are some bacteria, but see how organized are those parasites. So there's one on the right side, going to the one on the middle, where she's going to have a baby parasite, a little minuta parasite. So it Already there is one on top left at uh, 11 o'clock. Now in the middle, you see the amoeba coming from the right side. Uh, it's just uh, pushing to have this uh, next new baby uh, amoeba getting uh, into life. So it's like uh, twins. So uh, I understand you guys uh, watch about bacteria, but I'd say... Uh, get out of this bacteria box. It doesn't get you nowhere. And st stop going uh, fast with the patient. It takes one year, so take the time to remove all this. See the same patient, still a lot of pus, some one epithelial cell. Uh, always now we have some uh, spirochetes and some uh, trichomonas. So you've seen the trichomonas in the middle. Watch, you see some more. So there's one trichomonas in the center with the flagella for flagella. Some spirochete, lots of pus again, neutrophil, some um, bacilla. It's not good, I know. But uh, parasite area is not uh, is really uh, eloquent. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to have this in my mouth. So this is what most patients they have in the deep pocket. I mean, it's incredible. So a lot of parasite again, the amoeba in the center, a lot of pus, neutrophil, neutrophil everywhere, some um, chicken announce again, okay? It's absolutely awful to keep those things and not looking at not looking at it on a microscope. I mean, people don't know, patients don't know, even dentists don't know. It's incredible. So treat parasite, remove this, remove all this, and then you see those two trichomonas there. Who wants, who wants them? Now look at the patient when, when it's cured, okay? One year later, um, we get a lot of, you see in my protocol what we give. It takes uh, eight month therapy, and then we have two uh, control. Uh, three months and six months, and see low magnification, see cocci and filaments, okay? Uh, nothing's moving, no more neutrophil, okay? Just simple common cell normal biofilm, cocci and filament, and that's it. Then the patient is cured. Then you have removed calculus, but first four months, remove, the, remove the, those uh, parasites.